Hello, I'm David Lidsey. I'm Professor of Physics at the University of Sheffield. I'm the Director of the Electronic and Photonic Molecular Materials Group. As a research group, we've got two main interests. One is in the development of photonic devices based on thin films of carbon-based semiconductors. And the second is the development and optimization of third generation photovoltaic devices. A number of years ago, we became very interested in the use of spray coating to fabricate photovoltaic devices. One of the key players in the project has been my postdoc, David Mohammed, who's been working on the development of ink formulations for spray coating and also the technologies and techniques that we use to put together the complete photovoltaic device. I want to talk about the work that we recently published in Advanced Energy Materials on the spray coating of multi-layer organometal halide perovskite solar cells in air. Recent research efforts have driven a huge increase in the efficiency of perovskite solar cells to the point where they're now comparable with established crystalline silicon photovoltaic technologies. At present, the majority of work on perovskite solar cell fabrication is heavily reliant on spin coating. Spin coating can be used to achieve films with a high degree of uniformity and a well-controlled thickness. However, spin coating is not compatible with manufacture over large areas or at high volume. We've addressed the challenge of moving from lab scale processes to truly scalable fabrication by spray coating of perovskite solar cells. Spray coating is scalable, versatile and fast. It's an industry coating technique that can be used to deposit a variety of functional films from solution. In our report, we use spray coating to fabricate inverted perovskite solar cells in which all of the solution process layers, P.PSS, perovskite, PCBM, are prepared by ultrasonic spray coating. Importantly, we achieve deposition speeds that are 10 times faster than those reported by Dr. Blading, which highlights the commercial relevance of spray coating in high volume perovskite solar cell manufacture. Because perovskite solar cells are often made up of a number of layers that either transport charges or harvest sunlight, we need to understand a multi-layer deposition process to give us a full picture. Previous studies have focused only on the deposition of the perovskite layer. This work represents a major step towards a truly scalable perovskite solar cell. We believe this is a significant milestone towards commercialization. In our report, we have successfully demonstrated the applicability of spray coating by preparing perovskite solar cells in which all of the solution process layers have been prepared with this technique. Overall, our all spray cast perovskite solar cell has an average efficiency of 7.1% and a peak efficiency of 9.9%, which is somewhat lower relative to spin cast devices. This reduction in efficiency is due to lower surface coverage and reduced uniformity of the perovskite layer. This work is a significant advance on earlier findings, and as far as we are aware, it is the first example of an all spray coated perovskite solar cell.